inside my room and see the rest of my house. I have no idea why I'm whispering. Maybe it's to create suspense. Or maybe it's because I'm weird as fuck. I don't know. Anyways, here we go. Sorry about that. I have no idea why I'm acting so weird. Hey guys, um, so I'm gonna be showing you, I guess, what's outside my room. And I think I'll just be showing what's in the basement for now because I don't want to reveal too much. And there's a lot of stuff upstairs that will probably dox me. So I am just going to, um, yeah, leave it at that and show you what's down here first. I mean, this is where I spend most of my time, even though majority of my time is spent in there. But yeah, there's a tennis ball there. Um, <laughs> it's so random. Anyways, yeah, so this is my bathroom. And this is where I clean up. It's a nice, cozy bathroom, I guess. And... I mean, nothing to complain about. It's uh, fairly clean. I don't really leave too much a mess, too much of a mess, I think. There's the toilet, there is where I take a dump and take a piss every time I need to. And it's a, it's an all right toilet. It's not like those uh, Japanese toilets that, um, you know, with the bidets that, that spray your asshole and keep it extra clean, but you know, it does its job, I guess. There's some Lysol, um, and I'm not gonna be going over all of that for now because, well, it's way too much. I don't really know what um, products, products are good, so I just use some basic ass uh, stuff to groom myself, and I have no idea how to groom myself, so yeah. Anyways, we venture back outside into the real world and into the basement. But you might be wondering what's behind this door. And unfortunately, I can't show you because we're keeping some secrets down here, my family at least. And I don't want to necessarily show you who or what is behind this door. And I'm sure they, okay, that's probably a really bad joke to be making and um, might get me swatted. So I'm just gonna go ahead and say that there is nothing behind this door except a bunch of creepy shit. Just kidding, it's just a basement. Um, I mean, I mean, no, no shit, this is the basement I'm in, but this is like, I guess, where all the heating and stuff is. Probably doxing myself of all the brands being shown. But, you know, what's behind that corner? Should I show you guys? Maybe someone's... Okay, I'm not going to make that joke anymore. That's kind of um, a little bit too suspect. Um, yeah, just, I don't know, a bunch of stuff. I mean, I'm kind of proud of myself because there used to be a bunch of cobwebs. Uh like in the corners over there and like behind this door too and there's just like dust and like debris flying everywhere but I pretty much vacuumed this entire room so it wouldn't be so dusty and pleasant to uh, go into so yeah I guess that's it for here this is basically where we just uh, toss um, all our junk and this is just like a storage area except it's a lot smaller and I'm not going to open it because you can probably see a lot of the stuff up close and it might reveal, I guess, my location. So yeah, um, there's a nightlight there, which I don't really use. Um, I like to hang jackets on the stair post thing. Here we have a pillar. 
And anyways, I'll be showing you this half the basement first. And you know, um, I guess some of you have talked to me or I might have mentioned working out in some of my videos. And well, this is where I do a lot of my working out. And here we have a standing heavy bag. And um, what do I do with a standing heavy bag? Um, well, I guess the obvious answer would be punching it, but I'm not really that good, but I just, I don't know. I got really interested into boxing for a lot of reasons, so that prompted me to ask if my parents could buy one, and they ended, they ended up obliging. So, I mean, I guess they're happy that I'm keeping fit and not being a complete degenerate, so there's that. And here we have some... Uh, some training gloves from Amazon and yeah I mean I had some hand wraps as well but I didn't really end up using them a lot because eventually I found that my fist got used to making contact with this um, styrofoam heavy bag and if you've never punched one of these before it does take a while to get used to them and I used to have to wrap up my fists like extra thick in um, hand wraps just so it wouldn't hurt when I punch it but now I can uh, hit it all right, I guess, and not feel that much pain. It only hurts if I don't clench my fist hard enough and I make contact and it like, um, I don't know, there's no support so it like tweaks my finger, but otherwise it's all right. And yeah, um, this is basically the space where I do most of my working out. Here we have some 10 dB, not 10 dB decibel, 10 pound dumbbells if you're wondering why i say if you're wondering why i said db um it's because i'm doing a lot of audio work usually so i tend to get my units mixed up but if you don't know what db stands for it sounds for it stands for decibels wow i can't talk right now for some reason it stands for decibels which is uh, measuring a unit of sound but yeah um and here we have some or here we have a foam roller and you know i got this is given as a christmas present actually by one of my relatives because i don't know maybe they could tell how unflexible i was but i've tried foam rolling and i try to get in the habit of it because i do feel like it does help but i don't know i just i'm not good at sticking to things so there's that this is a skip rope that my um dad got but he doesn't really use it um because well there's it's not really that high up so um it's kind of hard to do to skip rope down here um and yeah i don't think he really does it outside maybe because he's embarrassed or something so this usually just sits here um those 10 pound dumbbells they're not that heavy so sometimes i'll use them if to work out a part that's really weak or I'll just use them as a support for my wrist when I'm doing push-ups. So I'll just like grab them and then put them on the ground and then push up as if I'm, um, what's it called? Bench pressing or something, except that's on the ground and in the position of a bench press or push-up is push-up position. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with me right now, but I just uh, can't talk. Anyways, this is a shoe rack, um, some cheap crappy uh, thing that my mom got and it's basically a piece of shit. And um, well, I don't know. I just, this used to be in my room, but I moved it out here because I thought maybe I could hang like towels or something here, but this just stays here because I don't know, it fills out the room and makes it look um, a little bit nicer. So that's this half. And now we move on to the other half. And yeah, this is the other half. So here we have two um, sofas, uh, an old TV that was actually given to us by our neighbor because he moved out and he wanted to uh, get rid of some of his stuff. Actually, the most of this stuff is from the neighbor, like that um, that desk TV stand and um, 
that little like ottoman thing where the laptop case is on and yeah anyways i used to uh play my ps4 here when i first got it but i ended up selling it because i just really wasn't playing it anymore and i was uh the ps4 pro was um already out so i kind of felt that my device was obsolete and um i don't know i just wasn't really using it anymore so i just sold it so now we just have a really old blu-ray player a really really old dvd player and some old speakers and this sound system thing which i guess is kind of nice and it connects to the blu-ray player which acts as the um audio whatever center for the uh stuff i don't really use any of this sometimes my dad likes to come down here and connect his laptop here and just listen to music on the tv using the sound system so i just usually close my door or you know sometimes once in a while i'll come out and try and talk to him and um yeah i think this is pretty much everything some family photos i'm gonna make sure that there's no names or anything there yeah i don't see any so i'm gonna well i'm not gonna move too close because all that stuff could potentially be used to dox me and we have um some stuff there with some more personal photos oh shit i showed it too much um and yeah and there are the stairs up to the first floor the ground floor and um that's where a lot of other interesting stuff is but unfortunately i'm not going to be able to uh show you guys that yet but maybe as i progress as a channel i'll reveal more and more of my house and that can be a sort of progression of sorts anyways i just wanted to uh upload this random video because well firstly maybe it'll allow me to start filming outside here and provide a lot more variety uh for my content because i could just like pace around my basement sit in various corners maybe sit against this pillar and record um in the hallway maybe even the stairs and a lot of good angles um should hopefully makes for some very aesthetic content and yeah oh there's a little window thing and shutter which i leave closed because i don't really want anyone seeing me in here and some vents and outlet and yeah um i don't know what else to say i mean i guess it's good that my parents decided to get the finished basement when they um got this place because well it's so much nicer i guess than um i don't know was in this room because well if it wasn't finished the whole basement would have looked like it wasn't here and it would have basically been unlivable but now it's kind of comfy sometimes i'll uh I do some of my boxing here but mostly i'm just doing it in uh, this area because well i can see myself throwing punches and well i can like i don't know monitor my form a lot better and i also like to uh i don't know do other stuff like facial exercises exercises which i'll get into in another video anyways I'm trying to keep my content kind of short we're back in my room now hopefully sort of have a general idea of what the, the totality of my existence is because I basically spend 90% of my life in this basement, 90% of which is in that room. Well, not 90, maybe 20 and I mean 80 and 20% out here. Anyways, hopefully you guys uh enjoy this video and i'm just uh oh yeah i just decided to uh record this to try and get into the habit of uploading much more frequently so anyways 
Hopefully this wasn't too boring and yeah, I'm gonna end the video. Peace out.